The operational staff of Russia's Belgorod Oblast has taken the decision to move the residents of several villages out of the area. Belgorod Oblast Governor Vyacheslav Gladkov has reported that many people have been injured and some killed in the border areas. A decision has been made to resettle the residents of the villages of Poraz and Dranovka in the Graveronsky district, and the village of Steri Kudr and the settlement of Pavlovka in the Valuyevsky district. The entrance to the village of Vyazovoy in the Krasnoyarusky district has been closed. Checkpoints are being set up, and it will only be possible to enter this settlement with permission from the administration. Unfortunately, the situation remains tense, many people have been injured and some killed. We must take measures to protect the population. The official statements issued by the Russian authorities make no mention of combat action. Gladkov said schools located in a 20km zone in the border municipalities of Belgorod Oblast would operate remotely. Earlier, he claimed that the situation at the border with Ukraine remains challenging but under control, and that Russian troops were conducting scheduled operations. 35 settlements are said to be closed to entry due to the operational situation. Recent events in Russia's Belgorod region have drawn a lot of attention due to the escalating military activity and rising tensions from the ongoing conflict with Ukraine. This area, situated close to the Russia-Ukraine border, has become a hotspot for intense military actions with serious consequences for both military personnel and civilians. Military incidents in the Belgorod region have surged, especially after Ukrainian forces ramped up their operations in the area. This uptick followed a significant push by Ukrainian troops into the nearby Kursk region, marking one of the largest cross-border operations since the conflict began. Ukrainian forces reportedly advanced into Russian territory, capturing several settlements along the way. The Belgorod region has been frequently targeted, facing drone strikes and missile attacks that have resulted in numerous civilian casualties. These assaults prompted the regional governor, Vyacheslav Gladkov, to declare a state of emergency, as the humanitarian situation in the area continues to worsen due to the attacks on civilian infrastructure. Recent reports also mention attempts by Ukrainian forces to breach the border at the Nekotayevka checkpoint. However, these efforts were reportedly repelled by Russian forces. Such incidents highlight the growing tensions and the complex challenge of managing the situation along the border. The ongoing conflict has had a profound impact on the daily lives of people in Belgorod and other affected areas. The city is now accustomed to frequent air raid sirens, and attacks on civilian targets are a common occurrence.